Hello everyone, welcome to your favorite cat catch me point class. So in today's set of the day, we are going to discuss a good set on say, calculated DI, not even calculated, but just a logical DI. If you can grab the logic, the set is doable in six to seven minutes. Okay. Let's see what is the set all about. The set says the function difference n takes a non-negative integer n as a parameter and returns the absolute difference of n and the number obtained by reversing the digits. यानी कि एक फंक्शन है आपका डिफरेंस ऑफ एन का मान लो ये फंक्शन है फंक्शन इज डिफरेंस एन ना व्हाट डज दिस फंक्शन डू ये फंक्शन के अंदर आप कोई भी नंबर डाल दो लेट्स से मैंने 13 डाला सो व्हाट इट विल डू 13 एंड 13 का रिवर्स 31 minus 13 18 मुझे वापस कर देगा एब्सोल्यूट डिफरेंस मींस कि मॉड वापस करेगा सो इवन इफ यू आर इनपुटिंग 47 तो 47 का सॉरी लेट्स से यू आर इनपुटिंग 42 40 का रिवर्स है 24 so 42 minus 24 18 he will not give us minus 18 it will not give us minus 18 right it will just give us absolute difference now it says that for a two digit natural number x so there is a two digit natural number x with distinct digits a set of six non negative integers p q r s t u is defined as so p is first of all the difference of x yani p ke upar main jo ek original number hai x usko par maine function lagaya to mere paas p aaya let us say hypothetically मेरे पास x 25 है let's say x is 25 then p would be 52 minus 25 that is 27 that would be the value of p q is the difference of p so q कैसे आएगा by applying the same function on p so q would be 72 minus 27 that is 45 r would be difference of q so r would be 54 minus 45 that is 9 and S would be difference of R, but that would be zero. Why? Because now it is a single digit number, right? It is applicable on a set of two digit natural number, right? So it will be zero. If this is zero, P is also zero and U is also zero. So basically my string starts from X and then moves out to P, Q, R, S, T, U, right? Now, let's say there is any two digit number A, B. A, B is a two digit number. Can I say in expanded form, it is nothing but 10 A plus B? And its reverse would be nothing but 10B plus A. Right? AB ka reverse hua BA, jo ki expanded form mein hai, 10B plus A. What is their difference? Their difference is 9A minus 9B. So difference is 9 times of A minus B. So one thing is very clear, ki jo humara difference aane wala hai na, the difference is going to be the multiple of 9, depending upon the difference between the digits. If the difference between digits is 0, so the difference is 0. For example, 11, 22. If the difference between the digits is 0, then the outcome is 0. If the difference between the digits is 1, okay? For example, 12, 23, 34. If the difference between the digits is 1, the outcome is going to be 9 into difference is 1. So 9 is 1, 9. So 12, 21 minus 12, 9. 32 minus 23, 9. 43 minus 34 and 9. Right? If the difference is 2, then the outcome would be 18 and so on. So I can see what are the various differences I can get. The various differences I can get is 0, 9, 18, depending upon the difference between the digits, right? So let's say my number is n. Uh, okay, so let's say there is a number n. Okay, with the difference between zero, digits as 0, different as 1, as 2, as 3, as, as long as my difference is increasing, my result is also increasing side by side, right? n5, n6, n7 and 8 and the maximum difference can be 9. 10 cannot be the difference. Maximum difference is 9 in the case of 90. Right? This can not be difference. So in this case the difference is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Now this number can be anything. Any number that has a difference of 0. If there is any number that has a difference of 0, what will be the value of p that I will get? Just think over it. What is the value of p that you will get? So first of first output you are going to get is p, then q, then r, then s, then t, and then u. So if the difference between the digits is uh, zero, so I just have to make it in one place. So just p, q, r, s, t. Now, if the difference between the digits is 0, for example, the number is 11, can I say that D of 11 is going to be 0, which means P is going to be 0. If the difference is 0, then P is 0. 
So if P is zero, everything ahead is also zero, right? Now, if the difference between digits is one, for example, number is twelve. Now I am just assuming it to be twelve. This number can be anything: twenty-three, thirty, forty, uh, five. 67 could be anything i am just taking one simple case because my difference is going to be constant so difference aaya mera pk case mein 9 since p is 9 iske baad sab zero aayega applicable on two digit number if the difference between digits is 2 so let's say the number is 13 13 and reverse is 31 31 13 it is going to be 18 after this what will be the difference if this is 18 the q would be 81 minus 18 that is 72 Okay. Then would be eighty uh, one minus eighteen. So eighty one minus eighteen is sixty three. Right? This is sixty three. Next would be sixty three minus thirty six. That is twenty seven. Next would be twenty seven minus seventy two. That is forty five. Forty five minus fifty four. That is nine. And then this would be zero. Right? For n three, this would be first be twenty seven, then forty five, then nine, and then zero. For four, this is thirty six, sixty three, twenty seven, thirty six, thirty six. The bar will come. Twenty seven, thirty six minus twenty seven, twenty seven, forty five, nine zero zero. Right. Five is the five to nine. Forty five, forty five. The bar will come. Nine zero 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 and zero. Right. Six. In this case, we will get our difference fifty four. Right. If the number is sixteen, for example, seventeen and seventy-one, the difference is fifty-four. After fifty-four, it would be nine, right? And then it would be zero, 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 and zero. If there is seven, seven into nine, sixty-three. After sixty-three, the series would be. यहाँ से पिक कर लेते हैं twenty-seven forty-five nine. Uh, if the difference is our eight, eight will give me eight into nine seventy-two. Seventy-two, twenty-seven, forty-five. Again, nine and zero, zero and zero. And the last case, if the number, of, if the difference in digits is nine, 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 the eighty-one, eighty-one minus eighteen, sixty-three. So that twenty-seven, forty-five, nine, twenty-seven, forty-five, nine and zero. ठीक है अब यहाँ पे हम कोई मर्जी नंबर पुट कर देंगे क्वेश्चन के हिसाब से अगर मुझे क्वेश्चन ने कहा हो कि नंबर डिफरेंस ऑफ डिजिट्स फाइव है तो मैं ये वाला केस लेंगे और नंबर में कोई भी ले सकता हूँ 16, 27 एंड सो ऑन राइट नाउ दे आर सेइंग द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज सेइंग व्हाट इज द इफ द वैल्यू ऑफ t इज नॉट इक्वल टू 0 सो t इज नॉट इक्वल टू 0 सो t कैन इदर बी 9 और 9 सो देयर आर टू केसेस इन व्हिच t इज नॉट इक्वल टू 0 देन व्हाट इज द लार्जेस्ट पॉसिबल वैल्यू देन द लार्जेस्ट पॉसिबल वैल्यू वुड बी व्हेन द डिफरेंस इज 9 डिफरेंस ऑफ 9 वुड बी 90 बिकॉज़ 90 वो नंबर है जिसमें डिफरेंस ऑफ डिजिट्स 9 आएगा राइट और इस केस में कितना आएगा 2 Yes, this would be the largest. If the difference is two between the digits of a number, I can take the number to be ninety-seven. So, just like I ninety-seven, lunga, this case will follow. Number liya ninety-seven, ninety-seven minus seven times eighteen, eighty-one minus eighteen sixty-three. So, the answer is going to be ninety-seven. Right? So ninety-seven is the correct answer. Okay. Next, question number seven. If D is the difference between the two digits of X, which means this. And D is four, so D is four. Then what is the sum of PQRSTU? So what is the sum of PQRSTU? So thirty-six and twenty-seven, sixty-three and forty-five, one zero eight and nine one one seven. For any value of x, what is the maximum possible total of T and U? T and U maximum total is nine, right? If x is greater than fifty, what is the maximum possible value of u? U is constant, that is zero, so u is zero. So this completes my set. Again, as I told you, a very little logic is used, nothing else. If you are good with numbers, it was a very easy set for you. I hope you guys have understood the explanation. If you did, please do subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much, guys. Have a great day.